So here we are in Prenton on Woodchurch Road to have a look at some old photographs. Some are old and some are a bit newer. So let's go and have a look and see what they're like today. So we've got this picture here. It looks like it's been taken from one of the upstairs windows of the buildings um, behind. These are the actual rower shops here. I can see the white, um, what was, petrol station in the distance. We'll go and have a look at that in a minute. Um, but behind us, it looks like it was taken from one of these windows, possibly up here. But we do have a lower down image, so let's have a look at that. Um, little row of shops here. Obviously, um, the shop names have changed. Uh, but there's the Waterworths, there's now that chai um, coffee shop. Uh, the William Hill is still there. In fact, if you look at the windows on the top, they're very uh, similar as well. Um, and I think that was a bank on the left-hand side, which is now, um, was Age UK by the looks of it. Um, and you can still see the deposit letterbox on the side. Uh, they've got a white label uh, there covering it up. There's a deposit letterbox, it's on the side of the bank there. And over to the right, we have um, the white building, which was the... Um, in fact, we'll go down and have a look at that now. Um, it's where Quick Fit is, and the petrol station was just down there. Let's go down and have a look at that. So we've just moved a little bit further down, and we can see here where the um, gap was, uh, which is where this uh, Quick Fit has now been built. And then the actual location of the um, white garage which was a petrol station until possibly up to the 90s, has now changed into this valeting center. Uh, so this one here is the row of shops on the south side of Woodchurch Road, just beyond Cambridge Road is to the right. I just up here and Sainsbury's is right opposite. So we've got, biggest thing we've got from this is all oh, the shop names have probably changed, but just how much uh, traffic is on the road in the picture. Just one person riding his bike, and there's another person riding his bike um, in the picture, and that is it. And there were the cars, uh, people walking around. If we go back into the middle of the road a little bit, just to be say that it's gone a bit quiet, um, but this can be a very busy road. And here's an example. So here we are back at the original photograph. I'm just looking at some of the differences here. The, um, the, the well, the middle uh, street lamps have gone. Uh, so that's one thing here. There's, an, there's now a pedestrian crossing on this island. It's on the left here. We can see it in both pictures to put a pedestrian crossing on that. Um, apart from the cars, which we can see here, I'm almost stood out in the middle of the road here to take this to get this right um, angle. And, and of course we can see in the distance on the right hand side there, uh, no Sainsbury's, and the tower down by where the um, dairies was at the bottom, and we'll zoom into there. Yeah, so if we look on the right hand side, you can see Sainsbury's is now there, uh, where we've just been, and, um, and it's not there in this photograph. Uh, so not a lot of changes, and all the shop names have changed, but there we go. Now let's see what we have just to the right of us here, is um, where we were before, the farm foods. And of course behind us is, um, behind the cars, is that Valentin Centre that we saw before. So have a look at the Sainsbury's, um, which opened in about 79, 80, 78, something like that. But this picture was taken in 82. Uh, used a very uh, wide lens, a bit further than I can go. Uh, so we'll have to move about a bit here. But um, parts of the, apart from some of the colouring that's changed, uh, not a lot has. See the front canopy is now white, used to be green. Uh, that's a big change. Two trees in this little, um, uh, this little bed, garden bed here. Two trees have gone. Um, just got some bushes in it now. But let's go and have a look down the other end of Sainsbury's and at the petrol station, or the old petrol station. The little covered area 
uh, just in front of Sainsbury's. One new walk down when it's raining, even if you're not shopping there. Um, well, apart from not being green, it's pretty much exactly the same. Um, but I'll tell you what, let's go and have a look at the old, old petrol station. Right, so the good old petrol station here at Sainsbury's, where petrol used to be pound fifty-seven and a half pence per gallon. Uh, what would that be now in terms of litres? About um, 40 pence a litre, something like that. Um, but this is the angle of it here. Um, yeah, we used to, I mean, now the road goes straight up where these cars are going, but that's actually straight through where the old petrol station was. It used to go round to the left um, and then loop around into the car park or loop into the petrol station. Now, actually, if we go round to the left where the new petrol station is now, that used to be just a car park. In fact, I've got to put some pictures up now from um, even from Google Earth imagery showing you where the car park was and where the petrol station was. Uh, right here where the cars drive through. The Loden Bay for Sainsbury's uh, has always been the same and the petrol station is just to the side of that.